at the moment, all of our products are available for everybody to see, whether they're a guest, a logged in public customer, or a logged in wholesale user. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to restrict the visibility of your products so that only certain people can see them. In the WordPress admin, you do this on the category page. So go to products, categories, and for each category, you will see some extra options. This is in the visibility section. So we've got a public and wholesale option, public only and wholesale only. So if you change these, then only the relevant people will be able to see them. Now let's change our music category so that only logged in wholesale users can see it. All we do is tick that box and click update. If you want more fine grain control than just public, wholesale or both for your products, then you can use WooCommerce Wholesale Pro with our other plugin, WooCommerce Protected Categories. This has extra options so that you can choose exactly which user roles can access each category and its products and also restrict categories to individual users if you want to. So let's say that your wholesale store sells branded workwear, which can, has on it the logo of a particular customer. Well, you can create a category for that one customer and restrict access so that only that user or that user and their colleagues from the same company can access it at all. To do that, you get WooCommerce protected categories from our website barn2.co.uk. As usual, you receive the confirmation email where you can copy your license key and download the plugin. And then in the WordPress admin, you go to plugins, add new. And then we upload it. You should be familiar with this by now. So WooCommerce protected categories, open, install now, and then activate. We're gonna click through to the plugin settings page and activate my license key. Now here you're going to want to untick these options because these options let you choose whether or not to show the protected categories and their products in the public parts of the site. Um, so that if you do that, then only the product page is restricted, but not the actual existence of it, not the visibility of it. So to completely hide them from public view, I'd say untick those boxes. And you can choose what happens if someone tries to access one when they're not logged in as well. So we'll ignore most of that and click save changes because the key thing we're looking at is what happens on the category page. So let's go back to products categories and edit my music category again. You'll remember that a minute ago I set it to wholesale only, but now we have two visibility sections here. At the moment, um, I have previously used WooCommerce Wholesale Pro to edit the visibility, but I want to use WooCommerce Protected Categories instead. So I'm going to choose which of the two plugins I want to use to control the visibility of that category. And I'm going to choose WooCommerce Protected Categories, Protected, and I'm going to restrict it to an individual user role. And I'm going to choose my gold role. So that way the only gold users with that role will be able to see the products in this category or the category page. And I could also choose um, which users can access the category. So that gives me extra control. You can either use WooCommerce Wholesale Pro or for that extra control, get WooCommerce Protected Categories and control the visibility that way.